Little Detroit Tigers will hit the field at Comerica Park this afternoon for opening day. And this year fans will notice some changes at the ballpark. That's right. Our Blake Hansen is getting a first hand look this morning. Blake, one of the biggest changes that massive video board behind you. Yeah, this uh, video board behind me here at Comerica Park, it is something uh, over 15,000 square feet uh, to be exact. And joining me is Vice President of Park Operations, uh, Chris Lawrence. Chris, thanks so much for being here. Sure. You, you know that the uh, video board is doing its job. When they lit it up about a half hour ago, everyone just turned their head. Uh, talk about more about the installation about this uh, video board and where it stands for all of Major League Baseball. Yeah, so we went from the, I think the 18th largest to now the second largest in baseball in terms of square footage, uh, tops in American League. But uh, yeah, it's a several month process. I think they started like late December, uh, kind of disassembling the old one, and then they've been going up until the last week, uh, kind of assembling parts, doing all the connections, behind the scenes mm -hmm. stuff, and doing all the programming uh, as well to kind of mm -hmm. get all the bells and whistles and the features up. So I mean, it's been it, cool. it, absolutely beautiful. Yeah. And, you know, it's hard to believe. Comerica Park was built in 2000, so we're talking almost 25 years now. Yeah. There's been some other changes that uh, is going to be noticeable for fans this year. Uh, maybe talk more about what's going to be uh, noticeable maybe around the concourse. Yeah, for sure. So obviously the board mm -hmm. is literally the biggest change that you'll <laughs> see when you come in here. Uh, but tied into that, a new sound system mm -hmm. uh, to really kind of elevate the mm -hmm. overall experience for the players, the fans, everyone else in the park, just give it a whole new level of energy. So, you know, those two things alone are going to make a big difference. Mm -hmm. uh, up and around the concourse, getting a beer, getting a hot dog, whatever it might be. Uh, we've got about 350 new TVs mm -hmm. that have been installed in there uh, just to kind of maximize the viewing experience, fan experience as you go through the concourse mm -hmm. and make sure you don't miss a pitch. So uh, we're excited about it. Yeah, that's a, a great to, you know, especially with just uh you know, 25 years of this park, you know, things are changing rapidly. But at the, the bottom line is that it's what's going on on the field. And talk about just about how much goes into preparing this field as we approach another home opener. Yeah, the field itself, I mean, we were, we're blessed. Uh, I think we had the best grounds crew in the league or mm -hmm. in, in baseball, um, Heather and Kyle and their crew. Mm -hmm. uh, they start this year, they were able to start like late February, a <laughs> uh, little, little blip here in March, mm -hmm. but uh, they got a head start on it. And uh, I think you can look out there when you see it on TV or in person here, mm -hmm. the product itself is, uh, is pretty cool that they're able to do that, get it this green. Everyone always mm -hmm. asks, how do you get it this green this quick? So um, there's a lot of hard work and a big team that goes into it, but they do a great job and mm -hmm. um, you know, we're ready. Ah, that's awesome stuff. Chris, thanks so much for being here. Of course, I mean, I think this is the number one thing people are gonna notice when they head into yeah. the ballpark. This yeah, thing sure. really shines. Chris, thanks so much. And again, the home opener, guys, that is at 110 uh, this afternoon. There are a few snowflakes right now, but we're not gonna fry. The game will go on. It should be a pretty nice day for uh, some Tiger baseball. Out here live at Comerica Park, Blake Hansen, 13 on your side.